panelists from Africa and Asia Pacific is Indonesia. How are you? I'm amazing right now. <laughs> Absolutely. Here's your question. You tried cryotherapy as a way to help mentally improve yourself from this universe. What does that even mean? <laughs> well, I wouldn't say mentally, but it's more for my body. So it's basically where you enter a human-sized fridge in nearly freezing temperatures, and it's just to relax your muscles because, you know, us Miss Universe girls have to work out really hard. <laughs> should try it. I don't, I don't think so. I have no reason to be freezing. Black people don't like cold weather, so. Thank you, Indonesia. The next, Indonesia. There are so many people in this world who are left voiceless to the fact that they don't have a birth certificate. A basic human right. My charity, Voice for the Voiceless, is working hard to ensure all Indonesians have that right. I inspire to be a woman who not only stands for herself, but stands for those who cannot stand on their own. Thank you. Vietnam. The eighth contestant entering the next round. Indonesia. I am one of the youngest contestants here. I'm only 20. I was actually one of the youngest Miss Universe Indonesia's that has been ever crowned. That's something that probably sets me apart. I started my own foundation called Voice for the Voiceless. We raise awareness of the issue that 75 million Indonesian kids don't have birth certificates. A birth certificate can actually really help a child's life to get health care, education, protection, and future employment. It's an issue that doesn't just affect my country, but the whole world. Indonesia. Two spots left. These women are quite literally the best of the best, and they are ready to compete as hard as they can to win the title of Miss Universe 2019. All right, we are halfway through the competition. We went from 90 to 20 down to 10. Indonesia, congratulations! Oh my God, thank you so much. I'm super, super excited to be here because this is actually the highest placement my country has ever experienced, so. Congratulations, the highest placement your country's ever experienced and you're the youngest. You weren't even born when I was Miss Teen USA. I know you have a lot more competing to do. Go get your swimsuit on. Congrats, I'm so happy for you. Thank you so much. All right, you guys. Indonesia. That feeling when the adrenaline kicks in and the endorphin kicks in when I'm on the rugby field. That is when I feel the most powerful, when I'm in my element. First, don't miss it. We'll be right back. Later, Ali Indonesia. I chose the color gold because I think that gold is a very bold color, and I'm showing the world this is me. This is Miss Indonesia. This is Frederica. 